So this is a course that will give students, of course, the fundamental knowledge that they need, but very importantly, the hands-on training. So this is not just something where you come into the class and you just hear about some things, you actually work on real systems. So for instance, you actually work on industrial control system security using special equipment that we've actually built here at Bristol, which allows you to actually understand attacks and defenses against these kind of infrastructures. Similarly, working on uh, good examples of networked systems where teams actually defend and, uh, and attack these kind of networks works to try and understand how to uh, analyze vulnerabilities, but also how to secure them. And most importantly, as students will do their dissertation, they will have access to our state-of-the-art test bed, a unique facility of its kind, and one of the few around the world, which actually allows you to work on real-scale systems to try and understand and contribute to the advancement of knowledge in this space. Bristol has a thriving cybersecurity community. So uh, not only in terms of research and education, but also in terms of industry that actually is interested in building and securing such infrastructures. So in terms of research, we lead multiple programs of research in, in the UK, including the Refrain Center, which is the National Center for Protecting Citizens Online, to a center for doctoral training, and also Cyborg, which is the cybersecurity body of knowledge. We also lead multiple projects in a number of other national research institutes. So students will actually have the opportunity to engage with these networks, but most importantly also, we have a number of really good relationships with industry in the region who are deeply interested in these topics, and students will also have the opportunity to engage with interested industry organizations who want to, uh, who want to address their, their needs for recruitment, but also to work with students on interesting problems.